welcome back to my youtube channel it's mariama and today i'm going to be taking you guys behind the scenes i'm not taking you guys behind the scenes i mean i guess behind the scenes of my self-care day in new york city self-care but yes i like the past couple of weeks well the last week has been better but the week before that was just totally insane like i completely broke down i just felt like everything was piling up career finances family just overall life was getting the best of me and i don't know if anybody else can relate it's just an exhaustion and i don't think i've actually come to terms with everything that has went down in the last year because i think I'm kind of a person that just keeps going and going and going and if you don't ever slow down and reflect or stop to acknowledge everything that has happened it's like things will just pass you by and it'll just be a whirlwind like you'll literally be looking like this Mr. Krabs meme. Uh. That's not a good place to be. It doesn't feel good, doesn't feel grounded and it doesn't feel centered so I got this hotel at the Moxie in Times Square and I have a spa day planned for myself at the bathhouse which is not until six so I have like an hour I can chill out relax a little bit and I just want to say something else because I know a lot of people may be feeling the same way there's a lot of pressure to be successful to figure life out and just to get it right and we are so young there's so much more to do so much more to figure out and so much more life to just live I'm talking to myself when i say this you are not your career you are not what you do yes we all want to be financially stable and successful and thriving but that is not the only aspect of you you are not here just to make money pay your bills and die like there's so much more to you. You're so much more dynamic and nobody has it figured out. No one does. So I'm feeling like I want a beverage, a glass of wine, maybe a couple oysters or just some dessert. I don't know, something light. I decided to take my scarf off mm. my foot. Still nothing spectacular. I have my swimsuit in my back for the spa, so. We're on our way, lovelies. I just don't want anything to happen to it. It's pretty hot in that sauna. 
but it was feeling good. Just don't want it, my camera to get wet or overheat or anything like that. But I'll see you guys when it's done. Guys, I just got finished with my massage. Literally the best massage I've ever had. I feel so good, but on to my facial now. in Brooklyn I highly 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 recommend 10 out of 10 the massage the facial the pools the sauna everything it was just so amazing I feel so relaxed and I know I look sleepy because I'm just ready to roll over wrap up in these covers and take it to bed um, I'm gonna try to do something else for myself in the morning and then get back to work. I'll see you guys in the AM. Sweet dreams to me. Because uh, I am about to sleep so freaking good. So freaking good. Good night. go to Central Park to have a cute little picnic and this outfit would have made a lot more sense. Oh, the shadow. Let me see if I can show you guys in the mirror. Yeah, instead I think I'm gonna just go get myself some brunch and then I will wrap up this vlog, but the stay here was amazing the best sleep i've had in a very long time so i'm so 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 glad that i did this once i head to brunch uh it's probably like a five minute walk and then i'll be on my way back into life <laughs>